I want to talk about we're living in a real world pandemic crisis yeah, yeah. the employment rate is through the roof right now yeah. um you know for people who are trying to find work at this moment yeah I, what is your advice to them how do they stand out you know corporations are receiving hundreds of thousands of resumes daily absolutely do you have any advice for that matter for anyone who's sitting home qualified, have the skill set, have the experience, but they just want to work. And right now, for every job that's hiring, every company that's hiring, yeah. right, there are literally thousands of applicants. That's right. That's right. Yeah, so I have a couple of thoughts on that. My first one is don't be afraid to take a bridge job because there's such limited jobs that exist, um, you may not get that perfect ideal job this time around. Making sure that you have a job so you can pay your bills, feed your family, and ideally continue to build um, skill sets in the space that you ultimately want to be um, is kind of the holy grail, but don't be afraid to take a bridge job would be my first part. Um, the second part, is demonstrable interest. Um, so I always, when I'm talking to folks, I'm like, don't just tell me you want to do content. What is your demonstrative, like demonstrate that you are truly interested in that. If you are and you want to do film, you could be out shooting with an iPhone. You could be doing all of these things that show me that you really, really truly believe. I think those types of things separate you from everybody else who just has a piece of paper that says, I can or I should do this, right? Um, the third thing that I think is there's just tremendous opportunities specifically for young people um, to help people at the top of organizations. So many of us have lost employees, layoffs, furloughs, etc. I think there's a huge opportunity for folks to come in and say, how can I help and support, even if it doesn't necessarily cost me money? Hey, brother, this is what you're working on. Let me go do this research for you. I think for millennials specifically, they have so much to add to boomers who are at the top, right? Teach me, not me personally, but teach them social media. Teach them how this digital world works. There's so much value you can add. And guess what? When those jobs open up, guess who is the first people who are going to get those phone calls? those people who have been helping execs out, you know, the entire way. Um, so I think those are just a couple of things. You know, the last thing that I'll just say is to your point, a lot of times we apply to jobs as if we're the only one applying. And my rule is like, you have to assume that there's 5,000 other people applying for that job and what specifically is going to make you stand out. You're not applying to hit go on a black box, you're hitting, you're applying to stand out. And so you've got to find those ways. I think a couple of ways to do it is demonstrable interest and get in and see how you can help people even if you don't get a check immediately. What's up guys, thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love.